Hello, in this video, I'll show you how to make it so that regardless of the length of any one of your traces, you can always set another trace to match the length of the first trace without having to specify a certain length for any one of the traces. And to use to execute that, we'll use a relative pin delay feature in Constraint Manager. So go to Setup, Constraints, and a signal of interest is UTX. We would choose relative propagation delay under the electrical constraints and under net, under routing. So relative propagation delay. Then you would set your UTX by right clicking on it and then creating a pin pair. You create the pin pair, click OK. It will give you a warning. Don't worry, we're going to put it in a matched group. Then we need to make another pin pair for you. Rx will create a pin pair. It goes from one pin to the next. Now the trick is to add these two pin pairs to a matched group. So right click them, match group. How do I select both of them? You hold down the control key to select both of them and then you right click on any one of them and then create your match group. So then you click OK. Now here we can set it to all drivers or receivers or long pin pair. All drivers or receivers means that all drivers or receivers in the group need to be uh, matched to one another within a certain relative pin delay. So URX is by default the longest trace. So I'll just go with UR. Uh, it will automatically choose URX actually. Let's choose the longest pin pair. And just to verify that, we see URX is defined as the target because it does have the longest pin pair. And let's say I want to set the delay to a length. Now, ideally, actually, you want to set your delay to a delay of time within a certain percentage. So actually, this works just fine. But if you did want to set to a specific length, you could say colon 2.54 millimeters, and then it would set that there. Now you can minimize this and what happens is they are matched for their relative pin delay, right? But what happens if I lengthen this? Now we have a problem. There are DSC errors saying that this is of a certain length, but all pins that are or pin pairs that are within this group are not matching the relative delay compared to this longest pin pair. So now we have to lengthen this pin pair and pay attention to the delay at the bottom, the delay indicator at the bottom. And just when it reaches within that relative delay tolerance, we're going to apply it and they are no longer unmatched for their relative pin delay pin pair. And you right click, choose done and you're good to go. All right. So if you would just say the lower trace and make it longer, then automatically it becomes a new target for the longest uh, length there. And the reason th why it's causing this error is that it relative pin delays are not matching on these traces. What I can do is add a little bit of length here so that they do match. And the thing is, again, this software or this setting does not care about the total length as long as the two pin pairs within the same group are matched within a certain tolerance.